Okay. The purpose of making this video right now is to share a very intense rapture dream that I had last week. I think everyone would appreciate it um, if they heard about the dream that I had, so I'm going to share it. I usually don't do this because I get nervous making videos, but I think it's important, and I think that's what God would want me to do right now, especially because I believe that with everything that's going on in the world, with Israel, and all the different uh, Bible prophecy coming to pass right now, I think that we are very much on the verge of a new world order and a lot more things to come, uh, especially with President Obama being in office again. Uh, so let's just make this short and sweet. Um, I had a dream last week about the rapture. And in the rapture, I, or in the dream, I'm sorry, there was a person of concern that I was trying to keep from coming back inside the house. And this man was, he was pretty disturbed, and we all agreed that he shouldn't come back in. So I went to the back door to go lock the back door to keep him from coming back in to uh, cause problems with anybody. And <clears throat> as I walked to the back door, there was a big bright flash of lightning. So, so bright that it was just like, ah, you know, you just, you're just waiting for the sound of thunder to come down. And it, it was just, it was incredible. The, the, the flash of light was just like, it hurt your eyes. It was so bright. And I was waiting for that anticipation of thunder that you always get when lightning comes that close to you, that it's just going to crack down as hard and as loud as it can, and it's just, it's just terrifying. But in that split second, I mean, I'm talking faster than a second. It was just like realization, an in, in incredible instant realization that it was the rapture. And I literally thought it was the rapture happening. That's how real it was, because as soon as it was like, you know, it was like God's voice was the, was the rapture. The rapture was the thunder. And as soon as we were, boom, up, it, it was like being lifted up into the sky so fast, like the opposite of what a roller coaster feels like, just being pulled up so fast. And during this intense pulling up, it was just like I lost all my breath. It was like, I was like, you know, I couldn't catch anything. I was all alone in this rapture. Um, I didn't care about anything that was going on back at, back home or who was coming. It was all just being in the moment of that fraction of a second, knowing that you're being, that the rapture was occurring. And all around me during this time of being lifted up, there was these little like flashes of lightning going all around me, like zing, 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 psh, 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 all over the place. And when it stopped and it finally the acceleration of being pulled up into the sky, finally, I opened my eyes and I totally 100% expected to be in front of Jesus Christ, standing before him. And when I wasn't, and I was still in my bedroom, I thought that I missed the rapture. I thought the rapture happened, and I was left behind. That's how real it was. I was laying in bed waiting for sirens of ambulances or chaos to start going on outside because I, that's how real it was. It was as if the rapture had just occurred, and I, and I knew it was the rapture when it was happening. So an incredible rapture vision, rapture dream. I think it lines up with scripture. Um, and it happened to me last week. I still can't get it out of my head. It's amazing. On top of that, I've had dreams of actually seeing Jesus Christ. Uh, I think it was last year around this time. I had a dream of actually seeing Jesus Christ for the first time, and he was clothed in this beautiful garment. The soft, fuzzy, just, just, you know, it just laid on him perfectly. And his skin was like this glistening, like, iridescent or just a glow to him, and it was, it was pure beauty. I mean, he was just gorgeous, and you can't even explain gorgeous because even being flesh and blood as we are looking at it from our eyes, it's a spiritual beauty that you can't explain because we're all part of being in the flesh. You know what I mean? We can't see with those eyes until we're there. And that's what I was seeing in my dream is that he was just so gorgeous, and he was pretty much telling me that he was coming back soon. And that was last year. That was 2011. And today is 
what, December 1st, 2012, when the dream happened seven days ago, right? About seven days ago. And there's just so many visions and dreams that are happening out there. I, I just know that I had to share this with everyone so they can compare that to their own visions and incidences with what's going on. And I think Jesus is speeding things up for us to all know. So if you're having a vision of the rapture or a dream of the rapture or anything else that has to pertain to scripture and what's coming on in the world, you need to get up and share it because it's happening quickly. He's coming back. He's coming back soon. And that's, and I mean, I've been a watchman for 10 years now and I've never seen it happening so fast. So I think it's going to happen really soon. I mean, we don't know the day or the hour, but we know the season. He told us what to watch for and every single thing that he told us to watch for is happening in our present day. So, you know, this generation is going to witness the return of Jesus Christ. Get ready. Be ready. Be ready. Get excited. Get excited because it's coming. It's like Christmas, but better. <laughs> anyway, that's probably the end of this. Thing. Anyway, my name is Trudy, and uh, thanks for watching.